Hello Pisces, this is Lisa with Inspired Art Intuitive here for your August 2018 reading. Yay! Alright Pisces, um, just so you guys know, we are here to help you lead a spirit-led, whole and healed, peaceful and prosperous life here at this channel. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're a repeat, a frequent flyer, welcome back. Thank you for coming back. Everyone, please hit the um, a like, subscribe, and the bell button so you are notified when I put up new content, okay? And leave me comments as well. All right, Pisces, here we go. So we are going to do a five-card reading. First card's going to be what's coming towards you. Second card's going to be... Um, what you're bringing to the party, energies you're bringing in for August of 2018. Third card's going to be obstacles. Fourth, what's going to potentially help you overcome those obstacles. Fifth and final card is going to be potential outcome and or advice. All right, here we go. One more shuffle. I like to pull from different piles. All right, here we go. We're going to pull the five cards out. Hmm. Okay. Starts out interesting. Ends very good, though. First card we have uh, coming energies coming towards you is the emperor in the reverse. So this could be an Aries might be causing you a little issue. Um, it seems that your rule and reign is being questioned, right? Everything that you um, what's coming towards you is people are going to question your ideas, your choices, your decisions, and you're probably not going to like that too much. Uh, but they are going to question everything. Um, on a kind of almost foundational level, but some of the decisions that you've made recently um, are going to be brought into question. Uh, what you're bringing into the party here is the Three of Pentacles in the reverse. So you're feeling like you're questioning me, and so you feel like this person's kind of pulling out of being a very good, strong supporter. So you're not going to feel very supported, or you're bringing that energy. It's kind of like, eh, 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 right? Like, I, why are you questioning me? What's up? I know what I know what I know, so just go with the flow and go with me, um, but we're going to get some more information here, and I think that there's a reason for this, Pisces, and it's probably a good one, um, it's going to help you in the end, but you're not feeling very supported, not very, you know, like, wow, I thought, you know, you believed in me, right? Um, what is actually kind of a um, an obstacle for you is the moon in the upright, right? Which is interesting because this is you. Um, you are your own worst enemy. In this in this month, understand that not everyone can grab a hold to your incredible intuitive nature, and just go with the flow as easily as you do. Those of us that are intuitives, as you may or may not know, I'm a Cancerian. Those of us that are intuitive and follow and our guidance of intuition, that's how we live. Um, not everyone lives like that, and we forget that not everyone lives like that. And, and we don't like to be questioned. Um... So understand that they're questioning you is not because of you as an individual. It's not personal. Instead, what it is, is it's strictly business. It's um, for your own good sometimes because it, it helps us intuitive people flesh out the idea and make sure that it's not just half-baked. Because what's going to help you is the Page of Pentacles in the upright. That is all about creativity, but creativity from your logical mind. 
Like, I've got some creative ideas. I've got some awesome things, guys, that this could work. So explaining yourself and communicating to the others what your intuition has been telling you, what you know to be true, and explaining it in a very childlike, less ethereal, more down-to-earth level, Pisces, is what's going to help you overcome the doubt, the fear, this feeling like you're not supporting me, you, you, why are you questioning me? Okay? Because the potential outcome, if you do that, you're going to see your hopes and dreams realized. You understand what I'm saying? Like, you're going to get to see the hopes and dreams realized in a real way, in like a, an awesome, manifested fashion. Everybody comes back around and supports you again in the end, as long as you do the steps of explaining the plan and coming up with at least a sketch. You know, sometimes I'll come up with some big ideas and high level, and people be like, mm, you know, they get it, like they'll be excited about it, but then they'll just be like, well, what about this, what about this, what about this, and you can't get upset about the what about this, what about this, what about this, why, because that actually helps ground and round out what you're working on and make sure that it can get off the ground and be successful. So then I usually have to come back with at least some sort of skeleton, like sketch, like this is real, okay, here's a little under the layer high level detail, but it's still some detail and that they can take and run with. Okay guys, that they can take and understand. We have to remember that everybody flows intuitively like we do. And then we can realize the hopes and the dreams. You guys were super straightforward this month. As always, Pisces. You guys were not complicated. You can get what you want. You just have to get, give a little information about what's coming in your head. Put it down on paper. Whatever. Put it in an email. But get some structure out so everybody can build the mansion and the Taj Mahal around it. All right. All right, Pisces. That's all I have for you. Like it was really literally that straightforward. You did not make me work this month. Um, okay guys, I really appreciate you coming, um, and watching this video again, like subscribe and hit the bell, um, share the video as well. Um, uh, but that bell will let you know, be, keep you notified when I put up new content and when I go live, which is almost every night of the week. Um, also, to contact me, all my contact information is down below. Email me at heartofinspiration18 at gmail.com. Should you want a personal reading, tarot, or you would like to schedule a Reiki energy healing session with me. All right. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. Thank you for all your support. Please leave me some comments. And peace, love, blessings, and joy be unto you today, tomorrow, and for all eternity. Namaste, my friends. Love you. Bye-bye.